There's five waves of energy. The first one's a ripple. It's a disturbance in the heavens. It's what the scripture says. Jesus said it in, in Luke chapter 21 when he said that for the powers of the heavens shall be shaken. We know that Paul wrote about it in Hebrews 12 and he said, I will shake both the earth and the heavens and everything else that doesn't remain will be shaken loose basically. I think I take that spiritually. So uh, we definitely, you said there'd be extreme straight line winds. We have. You said there would be uh, large hail. We had hail almost bring down a plane last Friday. You said that there would be uh, uptick in vol volcanism. We're on pace to break the record for volcanic eruptions in a for over 6.0 earthquakes in a year. All of the things you said, with, if we see these things increasing, then we know that this first ripple was even stronger than we thought. Mike, are we going to feel anything in the next six days as this thing comes ashore, basically? You know what, Pastor? It's very possible. And here's the way it's going to work. When it, it's going to enter, um, the effect of that wave is going to enter the solar system on the 17th. After, after, in the 17th, they're going to be tracking. Uh, it's very strange how they have to track this because it's not actually something a person can. Well, let's just call it a band, or let's just call it a, a tiny, 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 tiny wave. And so it will make its way from the outer band of our solar system inwardly. As it comes inwardly, the small one, um, uh, the effects of what it's having on the other planets, the probes, so on and so forth, will be measured. When it hits Ceres, uh, they're going to measure the certain things about this, about this small ripple coming through. One of the cautions that I gave watching volcanic activity was an indicator that the, the forces behind this thing are a little more than what was once thought. And as it gets closer, it, it's more compact. We've been feeling certain effects from the small ripple already, but it's just the energy. And as the core or the body of this thing passes us, now remember it's tiny, as it passes us, it could um, it could literally be, uh, you know, something pretty major or nothing at all. No one still knows, and the only way to find out if it's going to have an effect on Earth was to watch volcanic activity, because volcanic activity is is number one. It it's normally controlled by or or yielded by the core of the Earth. So, the what's happening inside the Earth. Uh, just about always reveals itself in the form of volcanism. Okay. And so if the energy levels inside the earth and the activity inside the earth are in fact increasing, well then volcanism will begin to rise and this is what we've seen. Okay. So again, uh, you know, I certainly have no clue of what, what will happen when this thing comes through. It could be, it could be a very passive event or So it actually goes all the way through. All right, so I'm getting that what I'm hearing you say is this is a small ripple, just the energy wave of this thing that's going to pass. Now, and it's going to be, and there's five of these waves coming. Now, you said, but when the body of this core of this thing, when it passes and, and it hits, and, and uh, it hits series. Now, when you talk about a body of this core, it's just, okay, you're saying we're now feeling the wave of it, the disturbance from it, but we're not feeling it. And I'm not going to ask you what is it, but I'm going to ask you this. Is, is the source of this energy waves a body, a planet, a mass, a comet, a tangible, solid something, rock? Is it something that's causing the waves? Pastor, from, from my knowledge, um, the source of these waves is massive. It, it's very massive. It, solid? It be is it solid? A, yeah. It's massive, whatever it is. It's massive. And when I say massive, meaning it's, it's very heavy. It's very okay. heavy. Okay. Um, and it has a lot of activity based on the measurements they've taken already uh, of the energy it's emitting. So 
it, it is affecting our solar system, I can say this, the, 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 the central portion of where these things did emit themselves from uh, is actually affecting everything. It's affecting everything. And so, but that, now that's the source. The, this small ripple is followed by some more waves. Right. Now, in, in, let, let's do it this way. Your, your, this ripple would be your pinky finger, correct? Okay. That's, that okay. would be the intensity of it, right? Okay. Your pinky finger. Or let's just say you dropping, you dropping a pencil, okay? The next wave that comes through would be the equivalent of dropping Texas. What? What? So this band is very, 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 very... <laughs>